A person who holds in his heart grudge and hate and ill feeling and malice towards others. Clean your heart. My brothers and sisters, if you're a mu'min and you want paradise, clean your heart. Even those who you disagree with or those who disagree with you, just have a clean feeling towards them. Even people who hate you and who don't like you, in your heart, you don't need to have that enmity and hatred and malice and dirt. But rather, you can stay away comfortably, but with respect, with dignity, with kindness, with good words. You see, when there are two people and they don't like each other, you find one swearing the other, one backbiting about the other, and he is showing his enmity and hatred and the other is just saying, Alhamdulillah, how are you my brother? Salaamu Alaikum, everything okay? And that's it. He doesn't say much more. But in his heart, he doesn't hold the grudge. He says, never mind, that's my brother. He doesn't like me. We have a misunderstanding. Perhaps Allah will one day sort out his heart. As for my heart, it's clean. That is a mu'min. You deserve Jannah. Do you know why? The hadith of the Prophet ﷺ once, he pointed at a companion who was walking away and he told his companions, if you want to see a person from paradise, that's the man. So they followed him trying to find out what exactly is he doing and so on. And they found subhanallah that this person was not doing more ibadah or extra things. But what he did say is there is only one thing I know that I do every night before I recline. I clean my heart of hatred, enmity, malice, jealousy, etc, etc against anyone else. And the Prophet ﷺ confirmed that that was a quality of Jannah. That's why the Prophet ﷺ says, if you are able when you are reclining at night to clean your heart and there is no ghillun li ahad, that means there is no ill feeling against others, then do it. Allah will grant you the reward of it and the reward of it is Jannah. Subhanallah.